Hello guys, welcome back to another video. The program for today is program to print the odd numbers in the array and replace even numbers by minus one. For example, consider this uh, five years input size and these are the array elements. Uh, um, here the odd numbers are one, three, five. So it will arrange in front, okay? One, three, five. Remaining the two and four uh, we are even numbers, we have to uh, reassign the value for even numbers minus one minus one here two even numbers are there so minus one minus one first we have to arrange the odd numbers in front side remaining position until the size we have to replace by minus one shall we begin with our program as usual i get input from the user uh, i declare an array of size uh, five then uh, here here the values will get stored like error of zero equal to one, zero equal to one. Yeah, here yeah, error of one equal to two, error of Two equal to three error of three equal to four error of four equal to five. Likewise, the element will get stored in an array. After that, I pass a method array and its size. It will come here. I just copy it. It will help you to understand better. Okay. Here, the array will like this, inum equal to, inum equal to five, okay? Inum equal to five. I initialize a equal to zero. I iterate your for loop up to size inum, which is five. Uh, it's check error of i percentage two not equal to zero, which is odd condition. For uh, i error of zero, which is one, uh, one percentage two not equal to zero. Yes, the condition true. So it will come here. It reassign i a error of a, which is i error of zero, a equal to zero, right? So error of zero equal to i error of i, which is one. So the resultant array I will show here, okay? So now i error of zero equal to one. Then for i is equal to one i is equal to one i error of one which is true two percentage two not equal to zero no the condition false two percentage two equal to equal to zero right so it will not go inside this if condition so i will get incremented to two now i error of two which is three three percentage two not equal to zero yeah it's a odd number so it satisfies the condition. So i error of a will get implemented to one, right? So i error of one, which is i error of uh, i what? Equal to i error of i, which is three, right? i error of three is, sorry, i error of two. I of two is three. So A will get implemented to two, then I error of two. Uh, now I error of one equal to, I error of one equal to three. After that, I will get implemented to three. I error of three, I error of three 
uh, higher error of three what four, which is the even number. So it will not satisfy this condition. So I will get incremented to four. I error of four, which is five. Five percentage to not equal to zero. So the condition satisfied. Now I error of a, which is two. Then I error of i, which is a I error of four. I error of four is five. So it will store I error of two equal to five. Okay. Then a will get implemented to three. After that, I will get implemented to five. Uh, five less than five, the condition false, so it come outside the for loop. Now it will come here. I is equal to a. Now I is equal to three. I less than five. Okay. Now I is three. I error of I error of uh, a. I error of i, which is three, equal to minus one. So the same stuff will appear in result and okay. Then I will get incremented to four. So I error of four equal to minus one. Now I will get incremented to five, five less than five. So the condition false. It come outside the for loop. It print system dot out dot print ln array dot two string of array which will return array of one three five minus one minus one uh, by opening and closing. Bracket. Shall I run the program? I one two three four five. Yeah, our resultant output is one two three. Sorry, one three five minus one minus one. One three five minus one minus one. We get our expected output as as I mentioned earlier. The odd number will arrange first. One three five. One three five. Remaining terms, even question, will replaced by minus one minus one minus one. That's all for today. Hope you understand the program. Uh, I leave the program solution in the description. Kindly check it. Don't forget to subscribe my channel. Thank you.